Hello, everybody, and I certainly hope everybody is safe and well. Monday is Martin Luther King's birthday, and we have that day off, but at our school, we consider it a day on. It is a day of service. So why Martin Luther King? Who was he? Of course, he's one of the greatest leaders of our time, winner of the Nobel Peace Prize, and certainly while he led and made his mark in the 60s, He's a leader for this time right now with his message of community building, his message of integration, his message of listening and loving each other, and this idea of the beloved community. This would be Martin Luther King's 92nd birthday. And so why do we honor MLK's birthday? We honor it because that's one of the highest things we can do in this country is to commemorate someone with their own day. So that we honor this day is a testament to not just who he was in the 60s, but who he was in the arc of American, and I would argue international, history. So why service for Martin Luther King? Now Martin Luther King has a lot of great quotes. We all remember the I Have a Dream speech that he's given. You've heard it somewhere. You've heard him somewhere. He was an awesome orator. But he gave, and I love this, it's like a query, it's like something you would hear around Quaker circles, right? This deep, thoughtful question that you keep coming back to for continuing revelation. And what he said was, life's most persistent and urgent question is, what are you doing for others? With that as the query that he left to us, we go about on his birthday trying to answer that in really active ways. What are we doing for others? In honor of his 92nd birthday, we will be collecting 92 bags, at least 92, of non-perishable food items that will support mana and some, the So Others May Eat organization. We will also be giving out 92 different ways to serve all year long. So that we're not just doing it on this day, not just in commemoration of his birthday, but in commemoration of his own lifelong and sustained commitment to love, justice, and service. I hope that you'll engage with us on Martin Luther King Day. It's a little bit of a different one because of the virtual format, but it's also given us a different charge to go beyond this day and to be more actively thinking about the question, the query that he left for us, what are you doing for others on that day and every day thereafter?